Hello newbies, welcome to my new video. In today's video, we are going to hack discovering vulnerabilities quickly with a targeted scanning lab in Web Security Academy and powered by Portswega. So guys, in this challenge, all what we have to do is to use a perp scanner to find a vulnerability, then we will use this vulnerability to get Etsy pass WT content and we have a challenge in here that we have to find the content of this file within the 10 minutes. So guys, to use the perp scanner, we have to use a perp suit professional edition. And as you can see, now the button in here of a new scan is lighting. So we are able to use the option. But if you are using a community edition, you're not be able to do the scan. So guys, without further ado, Let's find this vulnerability. And here we go, guys. So we have the timer in here. So first, let me activate Foxy Proxy. I'm using a professional edition. And then let me go to the proxy, double click intercept button and go to HTTP history. So as you can see, guys, this lab is very basic. We have only home in here, which is this page. And then we have these items so let me test one of them and here we go let me scroll down and see the functions we have or comments and we have only this button and i can assume that the vulnerability can be in here so let me check this talk and here we go now we have this one so guys in perp scanner we have two options we can go to the dashboard and start the new scan and then scan all the applications endpoint or we can make it very quickly and go to specific endpoint so let's go to the proxy let's go to this method call it product stock right click then click do active scan and here we go now as you can see the dashboard is lighting let me click on it and let me make it more big that we can see it and here we go now it's scanning as you can see guys now this is the request start scanning this can take a little bit of time so let's wait and see the result and here we go guys we found something interesting let me go in here and here we go so this is it let me make it more big and this is our target, call it slash product slash stock. And now he said that this is XML with X include. So let me copy it. So I'm using control C. Let me go to the proxy. Let me send this method to my repeater. And here we go. And let me test it by my own. So let me copy the payload in here. So this is the payload. And as you can see, he's using X include and he's exploiting it using out of band so let me check it let me go to the perp let me open collaborator client and now let me copy the clipboard let me close it and now let me replace the url here we go now let me encode it okay now let me send and let me more small so i can see them together let me open the other side. And here we go. Now he said that invalid product ID and we have this ID. Let me close enter Spectre and let me click the poll now. And here we go. Now we found that this was right. So be careful guys that sometimes when you are using automatical tool, sometimes we can find the false positive. But in here, this can is was it true and we have this vulnerability using the out of band and as you can see it in here so in case that this is x include let me de-encode it and let me copy it and here we go so i'm going to make some modification let me open my vs code so you can see what is the modification so this is the payload guys we have this href calling my my perp server i'm going to change it to etsy pass w d and in here i'm going to have another attribute call it parse equal to text 
And here we go. Now this is my payload. So in here we will use xinclude to return the Etsy pass WT content. Now let me replace it in here. And here we go. Now let me encode it. And now let me send the attack. And here we go guys, now we found the Etsy password content and we solved successfully the lab. So let's discover this file contents and see who are the users in the system. So now let me make it more bigger and let me scroll up. And here we go guys, now we can see that there is slash home Peter and then slash home Carlos user and Elmer so now we know who are the users in the system. And when we got the Etsy Pass WT content, we can reuse it to make a Linux escalation privileges attack. And this is can make us to become the admin in the system. And then we are also able to make several of other dangerous attacks. And here we go, guys. So this is how you solve the lab. And as you can see in the platform, we solve it successfully. So guys, I hope that you learned how to make a quick scan and learned something new from me. If you like the video, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like the video, and if you have any suggestion or have any question, please put it in the comment below and stay tuned for the next videos.